Hi, this is Coach Rooney Scoville coming to you from uh, Billy Harrison uh, Health Center in the, in the court in the wellness building. We're going to come to you with some basketball uh, drill work today. We're going to be talking about the jump shot. And we have two, we have one former player and assistant, both assistants now at Gulf Coast. And they're going to demonstrate for you uh, how to build a, a tremendous jump shot. All right, so we're going to start with uh, the three in, important words with uh, developing a jump shot is jump, hang, shoot. So we're going to work on the jump phase right now, and Paige McCallum and Shannon McCallum are going to demonstrate the perfect uh, stance for that. So we start for the jump phase of the jump shot. We want feet shoulder width apart on the line. You can see they've got the line, okay? And we just want them to jump as high as they can, okay? Jump again. Jump, again, shoulder, feet are shoulder width apart. Okay, so now we're gonna go back. Watch your ball, watch your ball. And they're gonna come in and jump off of two feet. It's very important you jump off of two feet. They're gonna back up. Watch your ball, Paige. They're gonna come in. So we're still working on jumping, and they need to come in and jump off of two feet. Last one. Good. Now they're going to get a ball, so that's the jump portion of the jump shot. Now we're going to talk about the hang portion of the jump shot. And what we mean by hang is the hang time that you create after you jump. So right now, because of upper body strength and lack of it, we're going to create the hang, hang time for you. So Paige is going to get her feet shoulder width apart. So we're working on that jump part too. She's got the ball and she's going to jerk the ball up and jump. By the time she's on top of the box, this is the hang phase of the jump shot. She's looking through, she's looking underneath the ball. She's created a window with her hands in the ball. She's looking underneath at her target. So this is perfect hang time right here. We'll get another, Shannon will come in. Again, feet shoulder width apart. She's got the ball, she's gonna jerk it up. By the time she's on top of the box, here's her hang phase. She's looking underneath the ball, elbow pointing to the goal and she's ready to shoot. Again, this is just the hang phase that we're creating for you to know what it feels like. One more time for each of you. Jump. Here's the hang. She's ready to shoot, but we're going to talk about that in just a second. Here we go. Jump. There's the hang. She's ready to shoot. All right, so now we're going to talk about the shooting portion of the jump shot. So we're going to freeze everything and then talk about what it should look like when she shoots. So she's going to jump. Here's the hang phase. Now she's going to shoot on the shot. It's real important. You see Paige has got a straight arm. She's got a bent wrist. She's got strong fingers to the goal. Beautiful looking shot. Next person, Shannon. She's got, again, let's go back and kind of talk about everything every time. Feet shoulder width apart. She's got the ball. She's going to jerk it up. She's looking underneath. There's great hang time. She's going to shoot. Key thing, she's going to hold it till it hits something. Straight arm, bent wrist, strong fingers, beautiful shot. So one more time each, and then we'll put it all together. Jerk it up. Shot. Nice. Last one. Follow through. Straight arm, bent wrist, strong fingers. All right, so now we're going to put it all together, and then we're going to take the box away to see what it should feel like without us creating the hang time for you. Here we go. Beautiful shot. And remember, they're holding that follow-through till the ball hits something. Hopefully, it's hitting the net as it goes through. Nice. Last one. Nice. Jump, hang, shoot. All right, now we're going to take the box away. And let's see what they look like. And I'm going to pass them the ball, and they're going to put it all together. Feet, so their feet are already, they're not moving around right now to just build this jump shot. She's going to be stationary, feet shoulder width apart for the jump phase. She's going to jerk the ball up, hang, shoot. That's a beautiful shot. So they're going to jump, hang, shoot. Shoot. Jump, hang, shoot. And she's holding her follow through till the ball hits something. Last one. Good. 
Now, the only two ways to shoot a jump shot is either off the pass or off the dribble. So we're going to come in from the wing. So we, we call this wing to middle. Shannon's going to take two dribbles and get to that same spot that we just worked on. And she's going to jump, hang, shoot off the dribble. Jump, hang, shoot. Beautiful shot. Now Paige is going to come in off the pass, and I'm going to pass it to her. Same thing. Jump, hang, shoot. And if you notice, their feet are shoulder width apart. They jerk the ball up. They look underneath the ball, create hang time, and they follow through. Beautiful shot. Last one off the dribble. Last one off the pass. And we can do the other angle. So you can work from all kinds of different angles. This time, Paige, uh, Shannon will go off the dribble, wing to baseline. So same thing, two dribbles. Oh, I'm sorry, Paige. Nice. Jump, hang, shoot. Beautiful shot. Now off the pass. Jump, hang, shoot. Last time. Beautiful shot. Here's nothing but net. Good, nice shot, off the pass. And we always quit on a mate. So we'll get Shannon to make it. Always quit on a mate. All right, here, Paige. here we go. Last one, that's it, went in. And that's... There we go. So that's our portion of the jump shot. Hopefully next week we'll come back to you and break that down even more and show you some drills that you can utilize to improve that jumper. But this is two uh, great assistant coaches right here. Uh, if you work on that, uh, you're going to be a tremendous, you know, add another skill set to your, to your game.